We're on the set of a graduation film, Starfish, um, and the graduation films are the, the point just before the students graduate. So for three years they're with us and we develop scripts and stories and craft skills and we take them through those in various projects when they're in first year, second year, through to the point where we commission pieces of work in third year. And all of the third year students work as heads of departments on those films, um, with the second years working as assistants and the first years working as runners. So they all come together as a major team. The great thing about the students at RCS is that they experience what it's like to be in a real shoot. Um, they work with professionals who are there to mentor them, they work with um, facility houses, they work with uh, hire companies. So everything that they're doing is real and that really does help them in terms of employability because as soon as they go into that first shoot when they leave, it's not unusual what they're going to go through. They know the processes, they understand what all the departments are doing. At the core of the grad films we have um, a group of industry mentors that work with them. Um, the leading mentor is Paddy Higson. Uh, Paddy's recently just come off of Katie Morag for the BBC. So Paddy is oversees the mentoring and we have today, for example, we have Cami Mercer, who's a leading sound recorder. He's out mentoring the sound department. Sheila Johnson's doing script continuity. So we've got the script continuity department there. Ray Tallon, who's a cinematographer, works in the, the, the camera department. Uh, each of the directors of the showcase films is mentored by a director as well. So we've had directors such as Michael Hines, Zam Saleem, Peter Mackie Burns, Pat Harkins, all who are seasoned professional directors who come in and they mentor the directors through the process as well. The key for that, or the reason why we do that, is that it not only advises the students about their own work, but it also starts to develop relationships with all of these mentors. So when the mentors are, are looking for someone to go out on a gig, they'll naturally approach the students if it's gone well. Showcase films are shot on the Red Epic, which is a digital cinema camera. Um, the Red Epic is used in, in, in high-end television, it's used in, in feature films like The Hobbit, um, and that's the camera department, but across the board and, and the course, we use industry standard kit. Um, we edit on Avid, which is a professional platform. We use EditShare, which is a file sharing network. Um, our sound kit is all industry standard. We, we hire in equipment if we don't have the equipment here. So for, for example, today, we need a specific mic for working on a, a sandy beach in, in the middle of Ayrshire. Um, so the students work with the sound mentor and they, they work out the best package and we go and we'll hire that from a local facility. So all of the, the kit that the students use is up to date and it's modern, it's uh, industry standard so that when they go out, they, they're going to pick that kit up again when they go out into the field. So it's very, very important that we use industry standard kit.